Hey guys, thanks for tuning in and joining me in this little uh, 11 day event, What's in the Box. Um, just to give you uh, an oil a day to concentrate on. I know some of you have uh, maybe have had your kit for a while and don't know what to do with it or others are thinking about purchasing a kit and wondering what are all the uses um, you, you can use each oil for. So we're just gonna concentrate again on lavender today. Um, I'm going to be posting a little bit of uh, fun facts, which I already did post that this morning, some just fun facts about lavender and some basic uses. And then I'm also going to post a little bit more of an intricate recipe for those of you that may be already using um, the oils and want to try something a little daring. And then on this video, we're going to focus on uh, a real simple recipe. So today we're going to be doing the lavender pillow spray. Now you can use um, this as a pillow spray uh, uh, on, your, on your linens even before you uh, fold them up and put them away. Or you can even use it as a room deodorizer, bathroom deodorizer, whatever. But it's very basic. Um, this is a one ounce spray bottle and you can get these on Amazon, I think in like packs of six. Uh, they're, you know, if you don't want six, then get together with some of us and we'll split up the orders with you. They're relatively cheap when you buy them in bulk. Um, you're going to just use a squirt of witch hazel. Um, it's better to get one that's alcohol free. Um, and then the reason we use the witch hazel is because it will disperse the oils in uh, the water or in the spray uh, so that way when you're spraying it you're not just getting all water you'll be getting a mixture of everything and then we're going to use six to eight drops of the lavender essential oil now you can go more or less to your liking if you would like a, a more faint smell then do six or four or two um, it, just your to your liking so you can play around with that and then we're going to fill it up the rest of the way with some distilled water so let's see how easy this is to do. So I'm going to put six drops in. And then I'm going to put just a squirt, it doesn't matter, of witch hazel. I also bought these cute little funnels on Amazon too that fit right into these bottles and it's easier to do that pouring. Make sure I don't go over. Okay, and then lid on, give it a little swirl, and you're already to spray your pillows down, go nighty night, or um, spray out the bathroom. Anyway, that's easy peasy. So I hope you enjoy these little videos and go make your lavender spray tonight. Thanks. Bye.